About time, what'd you get me? A chainsaw! Perfect. Let's get slicing. Oh god. Hey, what's up guys? This is Liz Katz, and we are gonna play some Kindergarten 2. I never played Kindergarten 1. I'm assuming there was a 1. Why would you have a 2 without a 1? Uh, however, I am myself a Kindergarten graduate. So I think we can handle a little Kindergarten 2 right now. To bring out the misshapen elephant in the room, I did get some fillers yesterday, being the basic girl I am, and decided to film today when its swelling is at its worst. So, which is maybe a wee bit swollen today. Uh, rest assured, I should be looking good again by tomorrow. Hopefully. But here we are today, being this hot mess. This already looks very reminiscent of kindergarten. I didn't have the bouncy boob lady though. Tuesday! Hmm, why wouldn't we start this on Monday? Hey, looks like this is a new save file. Be sure to check out the help section at the pause menu to learn the controls and stuff. <laughs> Will do, kid. I'm definitely gonna do that. That's also where you can find the mission map. I'll tell you what the story missions you can do with the stuff you've unlocked. Okay, let's see. Okay. So, I... Guess we do little quest things, which unlocks other things we do. And I guess it's some sort of story following these things. Yes. Very complex. Am I ready to start another day of kindergarten? <gasps> yes! Alright. So, since this is called Tale of Two Janitors, I'm assuming the janitor is calling me filthy. Alright. Filthy! Absolutely filthy! Are you blind? Look at this place. That other no-name janitor over there has really let this place go to crap. You don't know his name yet? What? No, but I guess I should learn it if I'm going to draw up a kid. Go find out his name for me, now. Uh, okay, jeez. I'm back, we're gonna go find him. I did a way handicap kid. Hey there, kiddo. I'm your friendly school janitor. Um, I guess we'll ask, what's your name? Oh, how rude of me. I'm Bob. Most of the kids around here just refer to me as the janitor anyway. You can call me that if you like. Alright. Hey, I know his name! I know his name! What's his... Where does that voice come from? <laughs> what's his name? Come on, I got a declaration to draw up. It's Bob. So my nemesis has a name. Bob. What are you gonna do to him? What the janitor's code of honor says I should. Which is? I'm going to kill him and take his mop. That seems legit. Seriously? You bet. Take this declaration of war and bring it to Bob. Return to me when it's done. This will be for the history books. I guess it will be. This is a great first day of kindergarten. <laughs> hey, Bob. Hello again, little buddy. What's going on? The other janitor wanted me to give you this. Oh, thanks. I'll read it when I get inside. Go ahead and tell him you delivered it. I'm really looking forward to working with him. I doubt that. Ow. Just went through me. <laughs> Has it been delivered? Is war upon us? Yes. Excellent. My attack will be swift and sneaky. As soon as he's alone, his mop is as good as mine. I'll be sharpening my mop in the boys' room. Have fun with that. That's the bell. Everyone head inside to your assigned classrooms. I'm gonna go to class. Yay, it's our first day of kindergarten. Okay, kids, the teacher has a headache, so we're gonna be very quiet. It looks like the school has more funding than the last one since there are actually toys. Go play, just please be quiet. Okay, bouncing boob lady. Where are you? My dad drives a car like this. He said that when he dies, my twin brother Felix gets to have it. That's sad, Ted. Where are you? I just love this doll. She's so pretty, just like me. That's great, Cindy. 
Destruction was the best toy in the toy box. My friends and I used to play with him all the time before you new kids came in. Was the best toy? Yeah, but now he's out of battery. No friends, no toys. You new kids are the worst. We leave. Okay. I know we're supposed to leave. Hey, you can't leave. I'm responsible for you little monsters. I need to use the bathroom. Well, too bad. I don't have a bathroom pass for this new school yet. You'll just have to hold it. You don't look like you can stop me. I can give you study hall. Apparently, that's punishment for stuff here. Should I say go ahead? Go ahead. <sighs> oh, hello. Uh, lovely weather we're having. Uh, Nugget likes the weather. Um, okay. All right. Oh, yeah. Are you sharpening your mop in here, janitor? Oh, good. You're here. You're happy to see me? It's a weird feeling for me, too. I need your help again, or else I'm fighting a losing battle here. What now? Bob is currently hiding like a coward upstairs, and since my hip is made of glass, I can't make it up those stairs. What do you want me to do about it? I need a key to that elevator. I'm sure it's that little black market cripple has one. But I'm sure that, wait, that little black market cripple. You're the one who crippled him. And I'll do it again if that invalid doesn't give you that key. Tell him that you s And see if he'll get it up. I'll give it up. Get it up? Whoa. That was a bad mistake. Tell him that and see if he'll give it up. He's in that special smart class upstairs. Hold up there, new kid. You're only allowed to use the bathroom. Nothing else. Okay, so I'm allowed to go without a pass? Only until we can distribute pass books to you new kids. Now either go to the bathroom or go back to class. Pass book? We use pass books instead of traditional passes here unless it's a special occasion. They'll be distributed soon. Thanks for the info. Now stop dawdling and get back to class. I need to go upstairs. Too bad unless an adult says so. You aren't allowed up there. You need to go to the bathroom or back to class. No exceptions. But the Janet... If the janitor wants you to go upstairs, he can come and tell me himself. It's your funeral. Alright, Mr. Pointy Mop Janitor. We have a problem. Did you get me that key? The hall monitor stopped me. That grimy little power hungry! Come with me! Yes, Mr. Dirty Janitor Man who smells like a swamp. Hey, hall rat! You giving my little errand boy trouble? Rules are rules, Mr. Janitor. If you want him to go upstairs, you just have to. I guess I could just beat you like I did that other kid. Then you would have an elevator key. Excuse me? I said I could, Oh, my God. I said I could beat you till they give you an elevator key. No, oh, brain covered out. Hey, other hall monitor. Uh, yeah, man, what? Whoa, jeez, you totally wrecked Stevie. And I'll do the same to you if you even think about stopping this kid from helping me out today. Got it? No problem. Uh, do whatever you want, kid. There, it's taken care of. Go get me that key. I'll be waiting by the elevator. Okay, then. <laughs> oh, we got a new outfit. Oh, that's nice. Okay, what is with this guy? So, a smart kid class... Sorry, I guess that'd be the science class, because the smart kids go to the girls' room. Ooh, I guess it'd be you. You're the wheelchair kid. What the? You're not supposed to be in here. You're a stupid kid. Do you have the elevator key? I didn't even read. I'm just assuming that's what it said. Of course I do. How do you think I got up here? The janitor wants it. The, um, the, the nice janitor? The other one. Just, just bring it back when you're done with it. I can't get down without it. I'll try. What are you doing here? You're not gifted in any way. Get out. Out, I say. Okay. Should I go back downstairs now? Well, where's the key to this thing? Here. 
Well done, kid. Here's a walkie-talkie. I'll be in touch. Great. It is great. I'll let you know how the mission goes. We ride to war! Okay, we're gonna let him ride to war. I like this school. Go, go, go to lunch. I don't think you can make it. Make, oh, make me. I don't think you can make me. But, but, but please, go, go. We will honor the wishes of a dying child. Hey, kid! Come in, kid! What now? Things got a little, um, uh, sticky. Get up here now. I'm at lunch. Yeah? Well, it'll be your last meal if you don't get up here right now. I don't think I'm allowed to leave. Well, one of the new kids in there must have a way to get you. Get up here now, or I'll have another body to clean up. Okay, jeez. Um... I can't believe none of the new boys want to sit with me. I'm still stuck hanging out with these two losers. Good luck with that, Cindy. Hey, new kid, how are you liking the food? Um, oh, how do I get out of here? Looking to cause some trouble, huh? I can draw the lunch lady's eye away from the door for a fee. That's all our money. Mm. Okay. You got it, kid! This won't last long, so get out while you can. Hey, Miss Margaret! Look at me! Please, child, settle down. Return to your seat immediately. Hey, oh, it's you. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll let you buy so I don't end up like him. It's for the best. <laughs> Where was I supposed to go? Uh, oh, so, ah, he killed again! Who hired this guy? Finally, jeez kid, you move slower than a kid who was knocked out from a tree under suspicious circumstances. I'm here, what do you want? Well, in case you hadn't noticed, I won the war. Congratulations. I appreciate this. No, I appreciate the support I've had from my allies. That's you, kid. Which means we're going to have to clean up this together. Clean up? Yes, I'm the only janitor. It would be nice to have some help around here. You just killed your help. That's not true. You're my help now. Although there's still time for me to kill my help, so keep that in mind. Okay, so what do we do? I'm gonna get started mopping up this blood. You run down to the weapons closet and get me something to slice up old Babo here. Weapons closet? Yeah, the place where the janitors store our weapons. It's in the boys' bathroom. You're gonna slice him up? Of course, look at him. He's a big boy. Normally I don't have to deal with the big ones because it's harder to remove the bodies, so go find me a cleaver or a chainsaw or something. Okay, I guess. Here's the key, old Bobbo. He was learning how to share now that I've won the war. I'll be back. Goodness, I'm gonna have to check into rehab at the... Um. Nope, nope, nobody, nope. <laughs> okay. I guess we gotta go find the janitor's closet. Um, what do you say? It was in, in the bathroom. This thing is this. This is the door to the janitor's closet. It's locked. All right. And oh, this is where they store the weapons. So, what would the janitor want? Uh, I like this. It's dripping. He said chainsaw. So let's grab a chainsaw. There's a chainsaw and a shovel on the shelf. We're gonna take the chainsaw. Kindergarten is fun. C is for chainsaw. He's doing a terrible job. That's not how you mop. You don't like stand in your mess and just be like. He's a 
bad janitor. About time, what'd you get me? Ha chainsa! Perfect. Let's get slicing. Oh god. <laughs> well, looks like you got a skedaddle. I'll be in touch. Can't wait. Oh, before you go. Here, take this head. You've earned it. Great. Now let's get use a study hall. Okay. Well, well, well. Look at all the bad children. I expect you all to behave till recess is over. Please take this time to reflect on how to be less awful in the future. So this guy's actually called Dr. Farhead. I wonder why. There is to be no talking or moving to the bell rings. Is that clear? Uh, let's say nothing. Clever bunch. We'll see if it lasts. Since we can't move, I guess we eat an apple. Ugh. The coffee I had earlier during lunch is running right through me. I'll be back in a moment. Do not move or talk while I'm gone. Hey, kid. Come in, kid. We got a problem. Where are you? I'm in study hall. You gotta hide that head, right? Find a garbage can and chuck it. There's one in the mess hall. What are you talking about? It's that little penny girl. She's been following you all day. You gotta hide the head and stop her from getting up here. Imagine this is what, like, Morty feels like in Rick and Morty. <laughs> How do you know that? Some kid in a hoodie just came up here and dropped an envelope on the floor. He had pictures and everything. She'll be... She's been following you, kid. What do I do after I throw out the head? See if there's some way to trip her up on the stairs on your way if you can. Get her to fall and break her head open. Uh, how do I trip her? You're in that stupid class, right? Maybe one of those toys will do the trick. I'll see what I can do. Okay. There are a couple of toys in here. There's a doll and a toy car. Ooh, maybe we can send her down with the wheels of the toy car. This is a garbage can. It smells bad. All right, let's toss this head. I guess we put the car. Yes. Oh, look who it is. You're not supposed to be at the study hall. What are you doing here? Something is odd. Um, wh what's odd? Hmm, after looking around at the environment, I've noticed a hazard on the stairs and I'm assuming they put it there. Uh, no I didn't. Liar! I'm taking you to the principal's office! Oh man. Oh dear, the lights have gone out. I sure hope nothing bad happened. What the heck? We gotta do this again? Oh! Oh, we <laughs> Kindergarten is so dangerous. All right, let him go there. All right, goodbye, Mr. Big Head Guy. Yes, blah, 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 blah. Okay, let's grab the car. Yes. Let's go to the stairs. Yes! Let's get rid of the head. Yes! I'm looking for the janitor. Yes. Goodbye, little girl. Apple first? I feel like I'm supposed to get the goo. How do I get the goo? Okay, I guess we don't. 
My apologies. Good to see you're all behaving. Ah, there's the bell. Anyone who pays their lab fee can come with me to science. Otherwise, head over to the gym. We are out of money, so we're going to gym. Wow, what are you wearing, boob teacher lady? Sorry, my life is ruined. It can't actually get worse. So what are you doing here? Trying your best not to look... <laughs> trying your best not to look like me in 30 years. Go run laps or bounce that orange ball or something. I guess we can do that. I'm gonna just stand over there and try to keep the room from spinning. I wouldn't expect anything less. Hey, kid. Come in, kid. What now? We're almost home free. I just need a little help with some of the um, heavy lifting. You want me to carry out Bob's body? Oh, no. He, he's much too heavy for a small, worthless child like you. I need you to carry out that power-hungry hall monitor <laughs> I tenderized this morning. That's not really my specialty. So you want to carry Bob instead? Fine by me. No, I'll take Stevie. Good, I left him in the weapons closet. Meet me up by the dumpster behind the playground and we'll toss him together. If I must. Okay, um. How are we gonna get out of here? I kind of nuggets just off bleeding in the corner. <laughs> Let go! I wanna shoot some free throws! Get in line, new kid! This basketball is mine! Okay. Oh! Okay, who did it? Who threw that ball? It was this Jerome kid. He tried to take the ball from me when I tried to get it back. He just threw it in your direction. What? That's a lie. This kid came over and helped her snatch it out of my hands. I went flying and they made me let go. Both of you shut up. What really happened? Carla's telling the truth. That's what I thought. Jerome, do you know how bad my head hurts right now? Not more than the waistband on those shorts, I'm guessing. Okay, now I'm mad. Ow, hey, stop. <laughs> Just, <laughs> look at little whacking sticks. I got a whacking stick. Start whacking little kids with it. Whack. Screw this, I'm out of here. Come back here. This is making me feel better. Good work, kid, I appreciate the help. You think fast on your feet. No problem. All right, how do we get out of the gym? Can we pick up Goo now? All right. Uh, what the heck? This is the door to and get outside. Um, the trash can. Where's the trash can? Oh, there it is. Finally! You had me worry, kid. No way I'd be able to move all these poor corpses by myself. Yeah, this is great. You did bring the body, right? Yep. Good. Now we just need to toss him in the dumpster and this is all over. What the? It's locked. Who locks the dumpster? We gotta get it open somehow. We need... Is he the janitor? <laughs> it's a dumpster. It sounds like someone's laughing inside. Let's bang on the dumpster. <laughs> Who's banging on my dumpster? Oh, great. The dumpster woman. Everything was going so well. What do you nice people want? Do you want to give me some food? We just need to use the dumpster, you old hag. Well, there would be a price to pay. I need something, something more special than food. What do you need? I'm running out of this delicious green, <laughs> I'm running out of this delicious green drink. You wouldn't happen to have any green goo on you. That penny girl normally has some. Why would we have any of that? That's gross. I actually have some. Oh, delightful. <laughs> Go right ahead and dump whatever suspicious items you need to. Thanks, dumpster hag. My pleasure. You boys have a nice day. Yay, we can dump now. Hey, hey, well done, kid. Looks like we're gonna get away with this. I'm thrilled. 
There's the bell. Looks like it's time for you to go home, my little apprentice. Go ahead and leave the body. I'll do the rest. Hey, kid. Wait up. Uh, aren't we done with school? Phew. Almost missed you. Please don't kill me. Kill ya? I ain't gonna kill ya. Well, not, not today, at least. So what do you want? For your dedicated service today, I'd like to bestow upon you the spoils of war. What are you talking about? I got some good stuff about the Bobo's body. Some cash, a watch, some kind of medication, and this. What is it? It's a tool belt. I don't fix nothing around here anyway. You can also have this thing from that silly card game you get to play. Little kid kind of looks like me. He <laughs> he. Uh, okay, thanks, I guess. Now scat. The parent sees me talking to a child. I'm going back to prison. Yeah, now, now is a good time to leave. Kindergarten! <gasps> and we got an outfit and a belt and a card with a lamb with a cleaver from Monstermon. Monstermon. Wait. What? Okay. Wait. Wait. Yay! We completed our first mission. Well done completing your first mission. Now you can bring the item you unlock to school whenever you want. How? Head over to the shelf by the door. You can select up to three items to bring. Check your mission map to see which ones go with a specific mission. I got it. I think one day of kindergarten was already a lot for me to handle. I've learned a lot, grown as a person. But we'll be back for our second Tuesday on another day. Thank you guys so much for watching. I need for you to give this video a big thumbs up and show your support by subscribing. I'm telling you. We're a good group here. I think some of you are. I don't know some of you. You guys rock and I'll see you next time. Bye. I don't know why you sound like this, but you shouldn't, so stop.